Hi, my name is Onika McClellan, and my husband and I have the honor of leading and pastoring a church called Shoreline City. The scripture that I'm going to share today is found in 1 John 4.19, and it says we love each other because he first loved us. He first loved us, so therefore we should love one another. I know that sounds basic to some of us. I know it sounds quite simple, but I think it's important for us to walk out this scripture when we don't feel like we have the love to give. When we feel like someone is unlovable, that's actually when this scripture is tested. It's tested when you feel like you don't have it to give. But I think about the scripture in John three sixteen that says, God so loved the world that he gave. So a part of loving is giving and not just giving when you feel filled to overflow and you feel like today I'm just ready to love everybody. It's actually outworked when you feel like I don't have it to give. So my encouragement for you today is to ask God, show me who I need to love and who I need to love well and help me to do it from a place of overflow, not from a place of works. Because more than ever, our world is desperate to be seen, to be known, to not feel invisible. And it's actually by our love that they will know that he is real. Think about that family member that seems unlovable. Think about that coworker that gets on your nerves. Think about that person in class that you walk by their desk and you think I should say something, but you hold back. That's when we actually should walk out this scripture in those moments. So it's my prayer for you today to have eyes to see and ears to hear and to ask God, who do I need to love and who do I need to love well? Because that's how people will know that we are followers of Christ 